you guys, it's Miss Farmer here at the Pumpkin Patch. We're going to be learning lots about pumpkins, so let's go on inside and check them out. Mm -hmm. okay, do we have okay, you guys, so it's a dollar a person to get okay, into the no, Pumpkin no Patch, and I'm paying for three people. So how many dollars do I have to pay? Three, you're right. Ready? One, two, three. So let's talk about how a pumpkin grows. What do seeds need to start to grow? Remember we've been learning a lot about plants and you've been working on some of those activities in Seesaw. Well, pumpkins start with a seed and then they need soil. That's right, they need soil to grow. So here's the seed right inside of the soil. And then guess what happens? We have a pumpkin seed that starts to sprout and then it starts to grow. What do plants need to grow? What is something that doesn't show us here in this picture? Oh, you're right, it needs sunlight and water. Very good. And then as the plant grows, we have a beautiful yellow flower that blooms. And the flowers love to bloom and grow. And the bees come and they help the flowers grow and then the flowers help the bees with their pollen. So the bees pollinate the flowers and the flowers give the bees their nectar to go make that honey. Then once those flowers start to fade away and close and fall off of the plant, then we start growing little pumpkins. And here the baby pumpkin starts to grow. And what color is the pumpkin as it starts to grow? Green. Right, it is green, green in color. So then we move along now and the pumpkin, as it turns orange, it ripens and waits for you. So then we have a nice orange pumpkin. And this is my pumpkin that I'm picking from the patch today. My pumpkin's not all the way ripe, right? Because it has some green in it. But I thought this one was a cool pumpkin because it had a little circle area of orange. And I was thinking about drawing a really cool face on that one. So that's why I chose my pumpkin. Alright you guys, so we're going to take a closer look at this pumpkin plant. And remember when we learned about the leaves on the tree that fall off? Well, plants have leaves too, right? And then here we have a little pumpkin flower that's beginning to fade away. And what happens when that flower fades away? Do you remember what that sign showed us? Well, let's 